Hello again guys and girls, uh, I'm back after what seems like a lifetime of reviews and it's only been two or three days. Uh, I came down with a bit of illness, uh, wasn't very well. It, just the thought of eating a chilli in the state I was in a couple of days ago was just, well, it wasn't nice. So I was, I've, I've perked back up a little bit and um, I'm just going to get straight back into the reviews. I have missed it. Even though it's only been a couple of days, um, so yeah, I'm just gonna just get straight back into it. No messing about at all. Uh, as you can see, I got a hoodie of the best group on Facebook, CG UK. It's a group that I've met. You know, the majority of the people I talk to now, uh, and I thought, you know, support the cause. Simple as that, really. Um, and it's quite a trendy hoodie, if I don't say so myself. Um, so anyway, tonight it's going to be the Jay's Peach Ghost Scorpion. I had a bit of an incident with it that, you know, wasn't very nice, but... There you go. And I bet you're probably wondering, where's the stinger on the end? Where's the tail? Well, just as I was washing it under the tap before I brought it upstairs for the review, I dropped it into the sink and it landed. Stinger first and it broke off the end which I'm absolutely gutted about because it was you know It had a bit of a distance On it and it was a really 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 nice looking pod not that it still isn't because it is it's lovely Um so this is Jay's Peach Ghost Scorpion Um I'm just gonna cut this open now get into it and see what's what See now for the last couple of days, a few pods have gone soft and I'm quite gutted about that because the, the, three pods that I've had to bin, um, all three were Infinities and they were all quite large Infinities. It was one from Terry and two from Stephen Blair and yeah, I really, really wanted to try one of those but they were just, they were unedible. Um, you know, when I was going through pods today, a lot survived the break, which is good. This included, just going a touch soft, which is why I want to get into this tonight. Uh, and yeah, so let's get straight on with it. Let's get it cut open. That smells quite nice actually. Mouse watering already after a couple of days break I'm probably gonna get tortured. Slightly sweet smell but mainly floral like the majority of your super hots. Here's the inside. Now I'm gonna take a few seeds out of here before I eat it because one of my good friends Darren Smith um, who absolutely adores his chilies also in fact, it, I've known him a long time, probably. Uh, it's going to be six, seven years now, at least. Um, we was in the Royal Air Force for a short time together. And he loved his chilies then. Jalapeno mad. Um, and yeah, he's a grower. So I'm going to be getting a collection of seeds together for him from these pods that I've got here and be sending them up to, up to him in uh, Scotland. I'm just have to keep all these separate. Just bear with me a second. Well, I'll just get the last couple out and make sure there's enough for him to germinate. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Uh, yeah, there's 13 seeds there for you, Daz, so I'll make sure I get them off to you. Jay's Peach Ghost Scorpion from Stephen Blair. Thank you.
Fuoco. Ha. Very hot. Now's the time to see after a three day break whether my tolerance has been affected. Right, flavour, not keen on it. It was floral, a slightly sweet note as I was just biting into it, but mainly floral, unpleasant. But nicer than the Jay's Red. <coughs> Solid mouth burn. Um, I've got quite an aggressive tongue burn as well. Just sitting right like on the tip of my tongue, it's quite quite aggressive and stingy. Hell of a lot of drool, constantly swallowing. My eyes watering just in the corner, but I can't touch it. It's just a strong mouth burn, it's not going back into my throat either at this minute in time. Put a little bit about the Jay's Peach. Um, I know it's a cross between a ghost chili and a, and a Trinidad Scorpion. But if I get this right, they used a lighter variety of Trinidad Scorpion and crossed that with the ghost chili. And that's how the Jay's Peach got the, the lighter colour. Whereas I'm assuming the Jay's Red is just a, a deep, a dark red Trinidad Scorpion you know, cross with the ghost. No throat burn. First night back into reviews. Awesome. But it is quite a strong mouth burn. And I can feel it sitting in my stomach. My stomach's had a nice break the last couple of days. I can't see it getting any worse, it's not going to trouble me. Um, must still have the tolerance which is only good um, for what I've got coming next few days, still got some hot ones left. The burn has moved from the front of my tongue and it's stinging the sides of it now. trying to work out if it's going to get any further or if it's peaked. <sighs> Safe to say that one's peaked. Um, Jay's Peach, not much trouble. 
I'm absolutely delighted that my tolerance is still at a good level. Um, and it's been five minutes. So yeah, uh, first review back after my break. Didn't care for the taste too much. Um, with a very intense mouth burn, but to anyone with a tolerance, quite manageable. Uh, Darren, I'm going to get these seeds, take the seeds from the next ones from the next few days as well. I'll get them into little bags and get them sent to you as soon as I've finished my box of pods. It might even give them a little bit of time to dry as well. So, uh, so yeah. Thank you for watching guys, uh, feel free to leave me a comment as always and I will gladly answer um, yeah, and please subscribe or like. Um, so yeah cheers guys and I'll, I'll see you tomorrow night and I'll be back on my next review.